here in Indianapolis at historic Hinkle Field House. Well, it's March. Butler wins. Is that news? They're expected to these days. 75-58 over the Delaware Blue Heads to advance in the opening round of the college basketball invitational tournament. Kenny Rice along with Keno Davis. Happy to have winning coach Brad Stevens with us. Coach, congratulations. Uh, get that three-point team going in the first half to open things up against Delaware. Yeah, we did. Um, you know, Hopkins and Stagall both opened it up for us, and, and uh, I, I thought Andrew Smith, you know, obviously made a couple jump shots. That certainly helps, but... Um, you know, we've been playing like that in February, uh, and especially here at home. Um, so hopefully we can build on it. And, you know, we go to Penn next. And uh, and, and that's a uh, very, very tough challenge. But it's something that our guys are really excited to just see the palestra yeah. and, and play in the palestra. Um, then we can mark it off. We've played in Hinkle. We've played in Madison Square Garden. And we played in the palestra. And you played well tonight. And, you know, you were telling Keno and I earlier, as we're going to take a look at some highlights, you come into a tournament, you're in it to win it. It's March, you're in a tournament, you want your team to play that way. I want us to play that way. I want us to play focused. I thought our intensity was pretty good. I thought our bench was really good in the first half. I thought we got great contributions from a number of guys, but I thought uh, from a toughness factor, uh, Butcher and Barlow specifically really kind of lifted us and led our run in the first half defensively, and then we made some shots and got loose. You know, as you see these shots go in, you know, you're always trying to improve, and maybe no team improves more in March than your team. What is your focus? Obviously trying to win the next games, but what's your focus in going into practice? Well, I, my deal's been really um, clear with, with our guys. If, if you play well in practice, you're going to play. This is, this is about getting better. This is about our young guys developing. This is about our older guys going off on the right foot. And, and uh, you know, we started Butcher in the second half because I knew that he would do tough things and set a good tone, and then our young guys picked us up and carried us home. Good shooting tonight from everyone. Hopkins got on his roll. We saw Andrew Smith inside and outside. Will we see more of the big man scoring three-pointers? <laughs> we will. We will. I mean, Fromm can shoot. Smith can shoot. Um, they've been two of our better shooters all year, to be honest. Good job on the boards. 37 rebounds tonight. Assists 15 to 6. Anything jump out at you, Coach, other than that big win, of course. You know what? I, I just wanted to play well and play hard. And, and uh, it was hot in here tonight, as you guys know. Um, eight, we always say at camp in the summer, air conditioning's <laughs> been broken here for 86 years. So we just got to deal with it. <laughs> That's uh, right. Your 21st win. You're playing once again in March. Next Thanks. week, moving on to the second round. Yeah. Coach Thanks, Stevens, guys. congratulations. Luck, Appreciate it. Good Thank to see you. Guys. Thank you for being with us. More CBI action coming up here on HDNet. Butler's Bulldogs advancing on 75-58. If you've got it, watch it. If you don't, call your TV provider to get HDNet today.